Best shot of beating Conor McGregor in the UFC. There's a lot of guys, you know, to be honest with you. I think if Conor had to fight someone like Michael Johnson, I think Michael Johnson would light him up. Michael Johnson is too, just as fast, if not faster. I think Michael Johnson is faster. Michael Johnson has excellent striking, as you saw even in his last fight. He hurt Khabib early. But, uh, you know, I think Michael Johnson, maybe Tony Ferguson in that division. But if he moves up, 70, 170 is a whole different ball game. Well, you know, I think Willie can finish him easy. You know, a lot of different guys. I think I would beat him up bad. You know, it just depends. If he stays at 55, I think guys like Michael Johnson, Tony Ferguson, those are guys that would get him out of there. Right now, nobody. Nobody can beat him now. He's in his own mood. Nobody can beat that guy now. Man, you know, Connor's really proven himself to be hard to beat, but I would have to say, uh, you know, somebody like Khabib, you know, he's got he's to get into that distance and, and close that distance and stay away from his left hand and get him down on the ground. You know, we saw what Khabib can do uh, to high-level, high-level guys, you know. So uh, if anybody, I think, has a, has a shot at beating him, it's somebody like that or the Diaz, you know, people that are versed on the ground and can get it on the ground. Now he's uh, Khabib Magomedov. I think he's... Uh very strong, have a uh, very good uh, work in uh, the ground game in Jiu-Jitsu, no? uh, and I think going to be very dangerous for, for McGregor. Uh, I think I think Ferguson has a pretty good shot. I mean, he's very long. He's a taller fighter. And he's a, he's a little bit awkward as well. So um, I, I think uh, I think he has a good shot. Um, Wonder Boy, Wonder Boy probably would have a good good shot too. Again, longer fighter in in a, a different kind of style. So, um, yeah, either of those two would be would be a good fight. Uh, to beat Conor nowadays, in my opinion, Aldo for sure and Magomedov. Why? Because you know both guys are you know Aldo is a great champion. You know, he's complete. He can fight everywhere. You know. He's ready for all the situations. And Magomedov, too, he's a complete fighter. He, he knows how to fight on stand, ground, takedowns, and his gas is, is awesome, too. Whew, that's a good one, huh? Best style, best game. Me, Albert Morales, I'm going to come in. I'm going to take everything you got, and I'm going to keep coming. Um, to beat Conor, man, it's, 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 he's a very tricky puzzle because he's very good at keeping his distance, very good at, he's very precise, and he's very relaxed. That's the biggest thing is that he's relaxing there, and he can see everything. Um, I think Khabib would probably be, be um, you know, a little tough because Khabib can come in there and he's going to grind him out. We'll see, man. Connor's very good. If he comes back to 145, I just don't, I don't think those guys now with his aura, you know, he's moved up to 55 and beat up a 55, two 55 pounders. I think, uh, you know, those guys are just too small for him and, and too slow for him. É, pô, que eu acho que tem o melhor jogo para ganhar do Cronos McGregor dentro do UFC ali da categoria. Eu De verdade, eu acreditaria muito no José Aldo e gostaria de ver essa luta de novo, né, também. Mas é, é, é complicado falar agora. Eu torci tanto contra ele, ele ganhou todas, cara. Então agora é melhor deixar, deixar no gelo. Mas eu acho que a luta mais interessante que ele está devendo para o público é com o José Aldo e vamos torcer para que aconteça. Né? Bom, é, hoje em dia no UFC eu acho que o cara que tem a maior chance de ganhar do Conor McGregor é o Khabib Nurmagomedov, o russo lá, que, que esse é muito duro. Eu acho que é o jogo que não casa com o Conor, ele vai querer encurtar, vai botar pra baixo, vai amassar o Conor. Então, cara, eu acho que o melhor jogo pra ganhar do Conor é qualquer um que seja do tamanho dele. Eu acho que ele, ele, tem muita, ele favorece muito a distância, eu acho que o, o, Dias, o Dias ganharia ele de novo. E eu acho que tanto o Mendov quanto o Woodley, quanto esse cara também que lutou com o Rafael dos Anjos, o próprio Rafael dos Anjos, o Ferguson, eu acho que o Aldo, eu acho que toda essa galera, ele está fugindo por um tempo, mas vai ter uma hora que não vai ter para onde ele correr. Quando ele pegar alguém da altura dele, alguém que tem a mesma envergadura que ele, vai atrasar o jogo dele, ele não vai conseguir manter essa sequência de vitórias.